What is going on guys? Spasmatic here back inside Destiny and today is September 11th 2015 Friday or Jure day and it is week 53 of Jure. The first Jure of 2.0 and the last one of year one. So let's go check out what he has. He's located in the Crucible area near Lord Shacks and the Crucible Quartermaster. So let's go check out what he has for this week. For week 53 of Jure, he has all helmets. And to start off, he has the Helm of Inmost Light with a 34 strength roll, which I believe isn't too bad since they converted the rolls down to like a lower tier. I, I don't know if that's great, but I I think 30s is pretty good. So 34 is a decent roll. It's not bad. And this provides Death from Above and Headstrong for Fist of Havoc. So for the Hunter this week, they got the Celestial Nighthawk with a 25 intellect roll. And this... Uh, armor piece makes uh, Golden Gun fires one shot, delivering six times damage while granting Keyhole for over penetration, which is really good for PVE on uh, strike bosses or raid bosses. So I'd pick that up if you don't have it. And Apotheosis Veil for the Warlock. It has a 32 discipline roll, and whenever you activate your super, you regenerate your health, which is pretty good for PVE. Maybe uh, Crota's End uh, hard mode, I guess. I don't know if it'll be be good for Taken King or not, but uh, pick these helmets up if you don't got one um, yet. And of course, the weapon this week is the No Land Beyond. Yeah, the probably the best exotic in the game comes from the Dark Below, and I'm honestly being sarcastic. But uh, pick this thing up if you don't have it. I mean, it's fun to use in the Crucible if you want to do some like No Land Beyond sniping. It's not too bad, but once you get the hang of it, it's actually kind of fun. So pick, the, pick it up if you don't got it. And for the uh, Ingram, he's got the exotic chest Ingram, which I would say is pretty good. Um, if you buy these and save them for the Taken King, they will not, I repeat, not uh, turn into Taken King exotics. So if you want to buy exotic chest piece, uh, you will expect something from year one that you don't have already. So pick that up if you want, or if you need a chest piece that you don't have already. And... He's got the Plasma Drive, Emerald Coil, and Heavy Ammo, which I, they nerfed because uh, instead of uh, 5 for one Strange Coin, you get 3 now, which kind of sucks, but it's still Heavy Ammo, I guess. So yay for that. And obviously the exchange of 2 Strange Coins for a mode of Light. So of course he does not have his Telemetries because I heard they changed all the Telemetries into a single one instead of, like, instead of a... Auto rifle and hand cannon. It's now auto, like auto or not auto primary telemetries and secondary te telemetries and heavy, which is really nice. It saves up space in the vault, even though they increased it by a lot. It's still pretty convenient, which I kind of like. So, I have all the exotics that Zer is selling, and I believe all my helmets have better rolls as well. So, be sure to pick up your exotics for this week for Zer sure before year two, if you guys don't got any of this. So. I guess that wraps up for week 53 of Jure. Let's go say bye to him because it's the last Jure day of week or not, year one. And here my friend is teabagging with me, I guess. He wants to be in my video. So this will be coming up to the end of the video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys later. Back inside Destiny. Peace.